Um, let me break this down to you, uh, what affiliate marketing is. So there is, there's three components, very simple. There is vendors, okay? There's vendors. These are people that have a product, okay? Companies or people that have products to sell. Pretty simple, okay? Not a complicated thing to understand. On the other side, there is customers, potential customers, okay? There's vendors, there's customers, and then guess what? In the middle, this is you, all right? <laughs> it's me, that's you. So our job, what we do, this is the landscaping of affiliate marketing right there, okay? Three components. We're not gonna, you know, I mean, I can spend like a week just complicating things and trying to overwhelm you with information. No, let's just keep it simple. It, it is really simple. Success is simple. Business is simple, okay? We're gonna keep it simple but it's gonna be very powerful. We're gonna operate on a totally different frequency here than most people, you know? Okay, so our job is very simple. These guys, what, what, what do these guys want? They got a product or products, okay? They got different products, okay? It can be digital products, um, e-commerce products, it can be physical products, they got products, right? Companies create products, people create products, I create products. So what do these guys want? These guys want what? They want sales, right? They want sales, they wanna sell these products. So you have customers. What do customers want? Do customers want products? No, no. Do you want products? No, you don't want products. You don't buy products because you want a product, okay? You don't. I don't, I don't buy this, this marker here because I want an Expo low order dry erase marker. I don't, I don't care about the thing. What, I re, what do I really want? I want to be able to write on a board, right? And I'm just looking for, hey, what's a good marker that I can use that I can talk to my good friend that's watching me right here, right? And I can write on a board and my friend can see you. That's what I'm looking for. I'm not looking for a marker, right? Um, so when you understand, this is the first 101 kind of approach. Okay, again, we're gonna keep it light. Customers want a solution to a problem, okay? They're moving away from a, from a from, they wanna move away from a pain or they wanna move towards a pleasure, okay? So they're gonna buy a product because every product promises what? Every product promises or it should promise a particular result, okay? Result, very, very important for us to understand. Not the product, product is just a means to an end. But behind every product, there is a particular result. Okay, simple, easy light, right? Not, not a complicated thing. These guys want results, right? So they wanna move away from pain or they, move, or they wanna move towards pleasure. They wanna solve a challenge or they wanna gain something, right? So these guys are looking for results, all right? They're looking for a particular result, okay? So if I want to have um, if I'm selling a drill, okay, classic example. If I'm selling a drill, okay, and um, if this guy is selling a drill and I want something, do I really want a drill? If I buy a drill, what do I really want, right? I'll tell you about my case. I don't care about being a handyman. I don't, I don't do that stuff, okay? I don't do that stuff. I let somebody else do that. But if I wanted to, if I wanted to have a painting on the wall, I would probably need a drill to drill a hole in a wall, right? Put a screw in a wall and then put a painting on the wall. What I really want is a result, a painting on the wall. So therefore, what I would need is I would need a, a drill. You see what I'm saying? Very, very simple, very, you know, easy to understand, okay? So these guys want something, these guys wanna sell, these guys wanna buy, okay? But they wanna, they wanna actually not, people love to, people love to buy uh, because of what they're looking to achieve through that purchase. Okay, so there is an emotion behind every purchase, uh, behind every buying decision. The reason I'm, I'm you know, I buy a Mac uh, instead of like a PC is because um, I like the aesthetics of it, right? I, I like the graphics of it, I like the simplicity of it, um, and I like the, the, the feeling that I have when I'm wor working on a Mac. It's just me, personally. So I got my dashboard here, as you can see, I got an iPad, I got an I, you know, MacBook Pro, I got another iPad, I've got an iPhone, I've got an, a big, you know, iMac, I've got everything Mac, right? I just like 
the product because of the aesthetics of it. Because it just, it's just the feeling that it, it gives me. Okay, why do people buy Ferraris, right? Why do, why does somebody buy a Ferrari versus a Pinto, a Chevrolet, a Honda? Why, right? why would somebody pay a hundred, two hundred times the price, okay, for for the vehicle? if that thing gets them from point A to point B, same time, okay? Speed limit is like 65 miles an hour. You cannot really go that much faster, okay? Whether you're driving a Chevrolet or a Ferrari or a, uh, a Porsche or a, uh, a Phantom or something, you know what I mean? So what people are really pi paying for and buying is their feeling that is associated with a particular product, okay? So let's understand that. It, we're gonna get deeper into this stuff and as we're building out campaigns, it'll be really important for us to understand this. Okay, so a result is, is a feeling that they get after purchasing. So that's why people love to purchase, because when they associate the, the, the feeling with that purchase, the product becomes just a means to an end, okay? So our job as affiliate marketers is we do this. We connect buyers with sellers, sellers with buyers, okay? Customers, potential customers or prospects, and vendors. Okay, so this is me right here, and this will be you. And if I can connect these products with these customers in a way that makes these guys wanna buy these products, what I do is I, I call, I, we call this affiliate marketing. I become an affiliate for these guys to sell these products. My job is to find customers who are looking for a result, if you're smart, which you are, right? Now you're learning from Vic, you're here, okay? So your result will be or your job is to be is to connect vendors, customers with vendors' products, and what happens here is when you do that, you earn a what's called a commission. 